Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is about cleaning out your closets using the Kone Mari method. If you aren't familiar with the method, I would definitely recommend looking it up. It has changed my life. Um, step number one is to do what I'm doing in this video and basically whatever space that you're going to be cleaning out, and for me it's the closet, you want to remove everything that is from the closet and for me this is actually going to be all of my clothing so i'm also going to empty all of my drawers as well as bring down a huge suitcase from the attic that has clothes that um, i had stored away for when i was pregnant so basically the idea is to bring out every single thing that is in that category so clothes today so this is <laughs> baby sleeping beautiful so this is it and the idea is also to step back and sort of look at the gravity of your situation and see how much stuff you actually have that doesn't necessarily come to the light every single day. So this is my entire <laughs> mess. So much stuff. And nope, that's not a Barbie in case you're wondering. <laughs> ah, so much stuff. So anyway, first step is to take each item and hold it in your hands and ask yourself, does this spark joy? Uh, Marie Kondo says that if it gives you an elevated lifted feeling then that's that spark of joy if it gives you a little bit of a heavy feeling maybe a negative association you really have to pay attention to your body cues with each item but the key is to definitely hold it in your arms and see if it sparks some sort of joy don't ask questions like how long has it been since I've worn this or will I wear this again those aren't necessarily the important questions because for me I love sweaters but I live in Hawaii so Holding a sweater sparks a ton of joy for me, but yet I don't necessarily wear it all the time, but seeing it and having it around and in my closet really inspires me to work towards the things that I really want to do in my life that will probably take me to places that are a little bit colder in climate. Now with Marie Kondo, she actually recommends that when you're putting things together in your closet, that you work from left to right, making the heaviest items to the left and the lightest items to your right. Um, but I also think that's because in Japanese, you read from right to left. Oh, time for a cutest baby break. Now for the drawers. So both of her books illustrate her folding method, but basically you fold it into pieces and so it stands at the end is sort of the key. And you align them in a, this is horizontal fashion, vertical fashion. So you can see every single item and nothing is sort of hidden underneath any other item. I love having drawer boxes like this because then for really deep drawers, I can do um, double duty um, and double depth in the drawer and you'll see how that goes. Now for the shoes. I am basically wear the same two or three shoes all the time, but I still kept the shoes that spark joy for me. I love beige shoes, <laughs> tan shoes, because they go with everything and I basically have them in every style, but they're all beige. So there's all my sweaters. So I'm going to do the same method with the sweaters and because I don't wear them all the time, I am going to put them on the lower portion of this very, very deep drawer. Yeah, say hi to Tio, Tio Carlos. And then I'm going to put my shorts on top. So you'll see that I can take these out and then my sweaters are underneath and that way I can access everything really easily and nothing gets unfolded. I'll do the same thing for this lower drawer, all of my pants that spark joy. And you'll notice that I don't have any of my workout clothes in drawers because I, my new thing is that I'm trying to really honor my workout clothing so I have them hung up in the closet and then I feel like this will really motivate me and appreciate them and hopefully go work out. <laughs> so that's it everybody, I hope you really like this video. Definitely get her two books, Spark Joy and The Life-Changing Magic of Tidying Up. 